Roberto Santos, Bishop of the Diocese of Balanga in Bataan. It is in Central Luzon. Uh, first, I have been student of Colegio Filipino from 1987 to 1990. And I took up licensure in church history at the Gregorian University. Uh, I will never forget the opportunity and the grace that we can serve our Filipino migrants here. And during that time, I was uh, helping the Bataenos, Tagalog-speaking Filipinos, during at that time, uh, at the Our Lady of the Holy Rosary in Via Germanico. And it is very memorable because you can study at the same time you can serve that you can pray and you can work with the migrants so uh, we can say that uh, we have been enriched intellectually and we have enriched them sacramentally then after that i was uh, i have returned here and when i returned here uh, I was before academic dean of San Carlos Seminary, and when I returned here, Father Greg Gaston uh, took place uh, my position as academic dean. And I was here as a uh, rector from 10 years in 2000, uh, to 2000 to 2010. And the memory that I won't forget is every September, the fourth Saturday of September, we go around with the new priest. And of course, the, 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 the student priest, we go around <coughs> uh, within Rome and then outside Rome. So we have been enriched now uh, with, uh, uh, we can say, uh, those beautiful places and not only because of those beautiful places but those places uh, connected with the roots of our faith so those are the memories I won't forget that we go around and this is uh, very beautiful that uh, as a place we have to go around with our prayers that we walk with them and we go and we should go to those places that will, will enrich us and then uh, it's so it is so memorable because when i went home father greg after some seminary is the director so whenever i see my the years of my epicopacy, I remember always the years of Father Greg. I'm now on my ninth year, and Father Greg is on the ninth year of the MPCF. And we are looking forward with you coming back to the Philippines to serve the parishes, and we are looking forward with you that sometime we will work in the Philippine Church. Thank you so much. Thank you, Father Greg, for the, what you have done here. So beautiful, the places, and so much improvement. And we can see that is the hand that can build, renovate, restore everything. Thank you so much.